residents are calling these nearly impassable streets and packed front yards the tumbleweed invasion of 2014. It looked like a herd of cows coming. The tumbleweeds were just rolling in here. And after those tumbleweeds rolled in, they stuck. Could not believe it. The house, the, the apartments back there were buried. They were buried in, in uh, tumbleweeds. Eddie Ward lives in one of those buried houses. He says he and his mom were trapped inside for hours. Couldn't get out of the garage. It was <laughs> sky high. Couldn't get out. The tumbleweeds were right up against their doors. And oh my, it had to have been about eight feet tall. I mean, it was high. The city's public works department has been cleaning tumbleweeds since Sunday night when they say high winds swept thousands of the prickly weeds into town. These tumbleweeds are no joke. I'm standing in a relatively clear part of town and most of these tumbleweeds are still taller than I am. I've been lived here for 23 years and never seen this. So it's it's pretty crazy. The city says it'll be out here for weeks cleaning up the mess and while they work to clear paths for homeowners, Neighbors say they're bracing for the next big windstorm. As there's supposed to be really bad winds again today, tonight and tomorrow again. And so if those winds pick up before they pick all that up, we'll have it all over again. In Clovis, Emily Younger, KRQE News 13.